From simmering tensions between the characters to unexpected plot twists that leave us clutching our hearts, Yellowstone is finally coming to an end. But don't worry, these behind the scene details will keep you hooked. Who had to undergo horse training in the show? We will be discussing all of that and more. Knowing some of the behind the scenes details of Yellowstone adds to the enjoyment of the Dutton family drama. So let's dive right in. What is Yellowstone about? This modern day Western follows Costner's John Dutton as he frantically seeks to protect the enormous ranch from numerous competing interests. Yellowstone has not only become one of America's most popular television series, but there is also a universe of Yellowstone spin-offs, including prequels 1883 and 1923. Yellowstone will finish with the approaching second part of Season 5 since Costner desires to pursue other projects. It explores the real-life challenges faced by Montana ranchers and stars Kevin Costner, Cole Hauser, Luke Grimes, and Kelly Riley in key roles. The popular story centers around the Dutton family, members of which live on Montana's largest ranch. The Duttons must continuously struggle to safeguard their property from all others who want it for themselves. Therefore, the privilege comes at a cost. There are several characteristics of the show that set Yellowstone apart from other Western plays, and its impressive cast and acting is one of them for sure. The show was filmed at a working ranch. The Dutton family house is more than a movie set, it's a real operating ranch with a fascinating history. The property, currently known as the Chief Joseph Ranch, encompasses 150 acres in the scenic Bitterroot Valley in Darby, Montana. The ranch itself plays an important role in the program and has become an iconic place in its own right. The Chief Joseph Ranch provided everything the show required, including cottages, corrals, the bunkhouse, and barns. Fans of Yellowstone will naturally want to visit this place, so when production is completed, tourists may schedule a stay and receive guided tours of both the ranch and numerous filming locations. The property was researched by Yellowstone's site manager and booked by Cold Call at first. Aside from the main house, Yellowstone was shot in the corrals, barns, round pen, cottages, armory, bunkhouse, cemetery, and surrounding forest. A tour of the land and film sets is included with every reservation at the Chief Joseph Ranch. The Cast Members and the Cowboy Camp Having grown up on a ranch, Yellowstone co-creator Sheridan is an accomplished cowboy in real life. He really owns cattle and horse businesses in Texas and provides the majority of the horses featured on Yellowstone. Yellowstone's main ensemble must go through an extensive training program each year in order to be ready for the show's following season. It is disguised as Cowboy Camp, and it consists of learning how to rope and ride, herd cattle, and live off the grid like genuine cowboys. Cowboy Camp, organized by Taylor Sheridan, aims to offer performers a taste of what it's like to live as their characters. Cole Hauser, Rip Wheeler, Luke Grimes, Casey Dutton, Wes Bentley, Jamie Dutton, Denim Richards, Colby, and Jefferson White, Jimmy Herdstrom are among the guests. Certain cast members, on the other hand, were exempted from Cowboy Camp. Kelly Riley, Beth Dutton, didn't have any riding sequences in Yellowstone and she didn't need to go. Whereas 4EJ Smith, Lloyd Pierce, and Kevin Costner, John Dutton are experienced riders already. The cast is filled with actual cowboys. Yellowstone is loaded with genuine cowboys in the supporting cast, which speaks to Sheridan's striving for authenticity. Yellowstone seems true in part because some of the players are real-life cowboys. 4EJ Smith, for example, grew up on a ranch in Montana and has been riding since he was eight years old. According to set decorator Carla Curry, he even helped design the Yellowstone bunkhouse. Jake Ream, Jake, Ryan Bingham, Walker, and Taylor Sheridan, Travis Wheatley, are among the show's other experienced cowboys. Jake Ream began as a wrangler on the show before being put in charge of organizing the cowboy camp. Bingham also contributes behind the scenes by providing riding tips and coaching. Smith is the most experienced of the group, having spent years in the rodeo and stunt work before joining Yellowstone, while Ream worked as a wrangler on the show before joining the ensemble. The show's chef is a real-life chef. In Yellowstone, Gabriel Gator Gilbo is the Dutton's personal cook. One of the most notable sequences involves feeding a thirsty Beth Dutton a smoothie with two scoops of ice cream and three shots of vodka. 
Yellowstone watchers are well aware of how unpleasant a Dutton family meal can be, especially when Beth is upset. The role of Gator, the Dutton's cook, is performed by renowned chef Gabriel Gator Gilbo. He has done craft services for some notable movies like The Maze Runner and Terminator Genesis, as well as Taylor Sheridan's thriller Those Who Wish Me Dead. Gilbo has been a recurrent cast member since his debut as Gator in Yellowstone Season 1. However, the Louisiana native not only cooks for the Duttons, but also for the whole cast and crew of Yellowstone. His culinary approach is so distinct that the cast call it Gatoring. Ha! Ah. The actor who plays Walker is an Oscar winner. Walker actor Ryan Bingham is a renowned musician in addition to being a rodeo rider. Due to his charisma, rebellious temperament, and singing skill, he is a well-known Yellowstone figure. Given that the performer is a real-life musician, his songs are the centerpiece of many Yellowstone scenes. In fact, Sheridan created the role of Walker just for Bingham after they met on Wind River. On Yellowstone, Sheridan frequently gets to sing and perform his own songs in character, and his songs have been heard in such films as Nicolas Cage's Joe, Father Stu, and Crazy Heart. Ryan Bingham is a talented singer-songwriter who has released six studio albums. For the movie Crazy Heart, Bingham's song The Weary Kid was nominated for an Academy Award and a Golden Globe for Best Original Song, as well as Best Song Written for a Motion Picture, Television, or Other Visual Media at the Grammys. How Kevin Costner and Cole Hauser Were Cast Before Viacom took up Yellowstone for their new Paramount Network, author Taylor Sheridan delivered the pilot to actor Kevin Costner, who agreed to play Dutton patriarch John Dutton right away. Viacom officials were drawn to Costner's appearance on the show, which helped cement the deal. Costner, who is recognized for playing parts with strong moral convictions, brought to life the character of John in a way that no other actor could. Cole Hauser, unlike other actors, did not have to audition for his role on Yellowstone. Sheridan believed he'd make an excellent rip from the start and even built the character into additional scenes as the show progressed. Rip has been a fan favorite on Yellowstone, owing in great part to Cole Hauser's acting. It's difficult to imagine another performer playing the part now, and Sheridan apparently felt the same way. Hauser was one of the first actors to read the Yellowstone pilot because of his connections. The character of Rip immediately spoke to him, and the rest, as they say, is history. He also claimed to have liked Hauser's work in Pitch Black and Tears of the Sun, Tears of the Sun also starring Bruce Willis. Location and set details revealed Although the series is mostly set in Montana, the state only contains 4% of Yellowstone National Park. In actuality, 95% of the Yellowstone National Park is in Wyoming, with the remaining 1% in Idaho. The series, however, has nothing to do with the famous national park, since Yellowstone is the name of the Dutton Ranch. It is also the name of a river that flows through Montana and into North Dakota from northwest Wyoming. Although there is no mention of the Yellowstone River in the series, it may pass through the valley of the imaginary ranch. Forey J. Smith, who plays chief ranch hand Lloyd Pierce, is a real-life cowboy and stuntman who started rodeo when he was eight years old. Because the bunkhouse is where all the cowboys reside in the series, set director Carla Curry sought Smith's input on how actual cowboys would live while designing the set. To appear realistic, the Dutton Lodge is shot in a real-life private family house, with set decorators adding modern details while maintaining family artifacts unique to the lodge. Outside of filming, the lodge's residents maintain the decor all year. Over the show's five seasons, viewers have come to know and root for a large cast of characters. With Yellowstone's last episode still locked in the barn, everyone is excitedly keeping track of everything known about the Taylor Sheridan series before it rides out into the night. One thing's for sure, as long as Taylor Sheridan is at the reins, this saga will continue to grip us like a cowboy's trusty lasso. Are you excited for the season finale? Let us know in the comments if you are eagerly waiting for the show's return. Make sure to subscribe for more.